Hey guys, welcome to Diet.com video. I'm Sarah, your host, and this is a very special rant edition of the Calorie Minute. Today I'm here to tell you about an article that's been going around in the blogosphere. It's an article on SpikeTV.com. The top seven butter bodies. The true definition of a butter body is a woman who has a beautiful face but a body that's gone to butter. It's like the butter face, but in reverse. If you are rich and famous, there's no excuse for being a butter body. It's your job to look fit and hot. Celebrities are not like normal people. They have the means to pay for a full-time trainer and for someone to prepare their meal. The reason why I'm doing a quick video blog on this is because we did that video on Photoshop hoping that people would quickly realize that the images they see in magazines are not real and that the celebrities who look to be perfect in them, they're not actually that beautiful. They get retouched. It's not real. And apparently people like Nick Cole do not still, still do not realize that. So Nick, these pictures that you're seeing of these women, they're real. They're unaltered. You posted one of Liv Tyler at a beach. Now many images that you see of women at beaches are retouched. Some are not, like the one you showed. But it's just ridiculous that people like you are actually promoting this idea of perfection that doesn't exist. And then the blog goes on to say, the following article does not represent the opinions of Spike TV or its affiliates. Of course it doesn't. Number seven, Sarah Ramirez. Sarah Ramirez is a big boned woman who stars as a bisexual doctor in the TV show Grey's Anatomy. Normally when plus size women gain fame, they slim down and lose the pounds. Not Sarah, she has remained true to her pudgy self. Next we have Drew Barrymore. She says she basically lives on carbs and eats whatever she wants. As a bona fide star, Drew cannot do this. Otherwise, every hot woman in Hollywood will adopt a similar mentality and the world will be void of super thin, super hot women. Most men don't find super thin women attractive, so Nick, maybe you're just not attracted to women. Number five, Salma Hayek. Salma Hayek has a beer gut, which she tries to hide by wearing flowy dresses. Actually, she just had a freaking baby. Number four, America Ferreira. It's crazy that she has become a poster child for curvy women. She basically gives women an excuse to be fat. Or she gives women self-confidence to be themselves. I want to shoot this man. Next, we have Mandy Moore, who is actually one of my favorite actresses. Now that she's fat, her annoyingness shines through. She needs to do everyone a favor and get fit again. No comment on that one. Mandy Moore is a normal girl who has said that she enjoys eating and she does work out. She has a fit body. She has a normal body. Number two, the transformation of Liv, oh, sorry, Liv Tyler. The transformation of Liv Tyler into a frumpy frump is a tragedy. The angelic film star used to be one of the world's most beautiful women. Now she looks like a dowdy housewife who indulges in too many home-baked cookies. The only picture that this author shows of Liv Tyler looking dowdy, as he calls her, is at the beach. And you can clearly see definition in her inner thighs showing that she doesn't have a bigger and she has thin legs. She's a little bit of a stomach, but she also recently had a baby. And most of the pictures that you've seen of her in previous magazines probably were photoshopped. So it's not that she turned from an angelic star to this dowdy housewife, as you call her, but rather she's a normal, average looking person that was photoshopped in magazines. She's a freaking actress, not a trainer or a model. Next is Tyra Banks, of course, at number one, Tyra Banks. Tyra Banks is so desperate to beat Oprah that she has piled on the pounds. I don't think she gained pounds to look like Oprah. Ridiculous. For years, Tyra Banks was a banging top model. Her cover of Sports Illustrated swimsuit issue is iconic and shows Tyra at her best. Her Actually, her feet are turned inwards so that her thighs look thinner, and there's actually a space between her thighs. This is a trick to make you look thinner that she tells lots of people about. Wow, I hate this guy. And lastly, I want to ask all of you out there if you know Nick Coles to submit any incriminating evidence you may have against him. This article just may jumpstart his career with all the attention he's been getting. Even though it is bad attention, many people in the industry believe that no publicity is bad publicity. So, to make sure that this article does not jumpstart his career, send me any information you have, any including Facebook photos or pictures from college or if he might have screwed you over and you're a female, let me know. And don't forget to subscribe to the Diet Health channel. And if you're wondering why this 
article made me so mad. Don't forget, check out our Photoshop video. It has almost 2 million views, and many people seem to enjoy it. See you next time.